Kaiser. Yes. Nairobi new season. Sure. Uh, <coughs> you've seen the reaction to the appointment of the coach. Um, you know, what do you say to supporters as you undertake uh, this new change uh, in this new season? Um, I think the call stays the same. You know, we're asking our supporters to get behind the team. You know, to to come to the stadiums, fill the stadiums, uh, give the players and the technical staff and the whole institution as a whole all their support, all their love, and 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 and, and, and all their energy. You know, I think um, personally, we're very excited for the season to start. Uh, we've assembled a. I think uh, a very a fairly strong group, and we're just looking forward to make to ha having the coach bring out the best he can from the players, uh, and of course, you know, I think um, you know when 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 the football begins in August, you know, the, the big priority is what happens in the field, and we ask them to come out and support, uh, and to give us all the, the love and, and, and peace and energy they can for the team to succeed. So the question was like, what do you make of the reaction? Those are saying like, particularly positive about the change. Uh, obviously, it's mixed reactions. What do you say to those voices that have said, yeah. Uh, yeah, I think there's nothing really much to say. You know, uh, I think the club has taken the direction uh, that we feel very confident in. Um, and I feel also at the same time, you know, the proof is in the pudding. You know, the games begin, uh, let, the, let the fans come and fill up the stadium, uh, support the coach. Uh, and, you know, I think. Um, when it comes to uh, some not approving and others approving, I think it's about what is best for the club, uh, the direction the club is going in. And from the whole institution side, we are fully behind the coach and giving him the full support that we can. Uh, and you know, we're looking forward to the games to begin because at the end of the day, that's why we're here. And uh, Junior, it will be the coach's first season. What are yes. expectations? What will you, what's the mandate? To you know, the mandate, you know, if you're, if you're the head coach of Kaiser Chiefs, you know, um, the mandate is always stays very clear. It's to win trophies, it's to win league titles, it's to be on the continent. Uh, and we know we have our objectives of integrating youth, we have our objectives um, of, of, of getting the right experience, mixed experience and youth. So we know from our side certain objectives that we want to meet. And of course being head coach, you know, for Kazi Chiefs, uh, I think it's very clear. You get to win, you get to build something at the same time, but you're here to win. You know, it's, it's, uh, it's, it's very clear that we know where we want to be, we want to get back on the continent, play continental football. So uh, I think um, you can't be a head coach of Kazi Chiefs and not have that clear mandate. Can you can just squeeze one question? Yes. Can you please once and all clarify this issue of the army stuff? Was he ever in contention? Was he interviewed? Was he someone that you guys were picking up? No, it, it's, the Nabi stuff is, is very strange to me. You know, and, and I think that also it came at a time it's very disrespectful because Coach Arthur was was our head coach, and I think um, you know a, a lot was made in the media and, and things pushed in the wrong direction. And I think from the club side, we always knew the direction that we we're going to take. Uh, and I think you also have to act with the air of caution of uh, you know professionalism and respect for all the individuals. Um, you know, also we look we have a team like Younger who we just had a, a, a great uh, international friendly game with, looking to build good relations and I think sometimes the narrative in the media uh, was sort of you know, driven in the wrong way but uh, from the club side uh, you know we're very clear in that direction uh, and we're looking forward to Coach Nzeki um, giving us all his best to be able to take the team to the next next level. Did you guys look in his direction? Did we look in his direction? In Navi's direction, that's the question. Was he in the I, 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 I think for us, you know, we, we, it's weird because people were talking as if we didn't have a head coach, and Coach Arthur uh, was our head coach, and we just went through a bit of a restructuring phase, you know. So I think we're very clear the whole time in the direction we took, which in Turkey, and I'm looking forward to the best for, from the coach. Okay, um, Kaiser, just on what necessity of this change, because uh, you guys always give coaches time. Yeah, but after one season, you guys made the change. No, I think fast, like we said, it's restructuring. You know, Coach Arthur and Coach Nzeki have been part of the, the, the same structural system. You know, even even last season, we had Coach Nzeki, who was head of technical, working very closely with Coach Arthur. You know, so um, there's, a, there's a heavy youth angle that we still want to incorporate. And for us, it's just it's a restructuring, but uh, it's, it's a lot of continuity at the same time. You know, so it's people that have worked together, uh, and it's just uh, the direction that we felt at this moment in time was the best way for us to move forward.